Hi. It is February 6th, Saturday. I have six minutes because I couldn't take off the, um, I couldn't take out footage and download it on my computer because I still have a lot to upload. But I'm technically supposed to be in TJ right now, um, uh, giving out the donations. But um, I think I had mentioned at some family who lost some of their homes with the water, with the, um, the rain. And um, I ended up getting exposed by someone yesterday when I was picking up stuff, um, getting exposed to COVID. And so everyone's like freaking out and getting all these, you know, phone calls about not to go. And I'm fine. I know I'm, I'm going to be fine. But just, you know, to put everyone else at ease, I was just like, I'll postpone the trip. I'll quarantine. My sense of quarantine is um, being out, you know, in the field <laughs> or thing, right? Um, taking care of my my inner health because um, I really feel like that's going to help. I mean, not help my overall healing in general, but um, you know, I, I reached out to the, my cousins and just let them know that I was going to wait. And, but only certain people know, right? Don't need to cause havoc. Let that type of energy flow out. But anyways, um, spoke my truth. Just wanted to update on that. I didn't share exactly what I recorded that I posted before. For my own reasons, I felt like I shared what I had to share and that was enough. Um, but I was reflecting on it. I just so happened to, you know, part of like staying in today, I was like, okay, just be present in, in every task that I'm doing. I came across the actual, um, the actual, what I wrote down, what I had wanted to say. And there was a part in there where I was reflecting on it and I thought, you know, this person never really made me feel like I was some shiny toy to play with. But that came out. So I was trying to reflect and reflect where that came from. Like who in my life made me feel that way? And it, I remembered being out here, laying down, I was reflecting on it and I remembered, I, I remembered where that came from. And not a lot of people know this, but, and again, in an effort of just being authentic with my own healing, I thought about, is this something I, I, I really want to share? Is this something I should share? But I think there's a lot of truth to, to just some of these underlying experiences that we don't realize how much impact they have. And so um, I, 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 I was sexually molested growing up. Not a lot of people know, but that, that's where that came from for me. The sense of, of um, you know, whenever this person just wanted to, right? And, and it makes sense now that I, I realize that other missing puzzle piece of, of not having had a voice growing up, right? Not being seen growing up and this desire to be seen, this desire to yeah, to be paid attention to. And then that happened and, and there was a sense of like, you know, whenever this person wanted to. And, and I had resolved that, like I, I feel like I had resolved that. And I think that's why it, it didn't, it wasn't so apparent because I had already healed that. It's not something that's like, makes me fall apart crying every time we talk about it. I'm okay with talking about it. And I think that's why, it, but it, it just surprised me when I was reading what I wrote to say and then realizing that didn't happen with this person or with any of, you know, the more recent connections. It was really something buried from my past. And just being out here, I was laying and, and just reflecting and it came to the surface. But anyways... Yeah, I just, wow, I, I, 
I'm glad I figured out where that came from because I, I was wondering like why would I why would that come out? Why would that come out? Where did that come from? But anyways, um, meditation went well. I have about a minute left before <laughs> I run out of memory. Um, the circle was almost in com complete completion. And then there was in the corner, top right hand corner, it was radiating. But it was like a stronger radiation, like almost like a magnetic pole. Um, and it was like just radiating, radiating. And it was like, like it was just wanting to pull like from the past out. Maybe that's what it was. It just, there's this desire to pull, to pull out something from the past. Not from the past, it's just something that was stuck. And it, it would radiate, radiate, and it was like, we're just doing this. So I wonder if that's where that came from. I don't know. That's trippy. But it's going to die right now, so. On another note, I saw another dead spider. The one in the corner that reached out to say hi. I saw it yesterday, and then this morning it was gone. Or two days ago, and this morning it was gone. I think I have scavengers in my house. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later.